gorgeous set here at Wembley. A sea of fans beginning to descend upon the stadium for what ought to be a riveting Carabao Cup final. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. This is the time when the talking has to stop and the action finally begins. A warm welcome to Wembley from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson and we're just seconds away from kickoff time in what promises to be a wonderful Carabao Cup final. It is Chelsea and they take on Brighton. What a chance for one of these teams to get their hands on silverware. And over the years, we've seen some great League Cup finals. Let's hope today matches up to some of those occasions. Really looking forward to this one, Derek. Pressing as a team. The high press was very much on. Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, they won't come closer than that. So unlucky not to take the lead there. Well, not on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Well, Kai Havertz, a gifted, naturally left-footed player who can dominate any game. Oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. Well, the short corner routine. Conte will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead. And a goal for Chelsea! They hit the front in the final! How important will that be? Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So the game has restarted, and Chelsea are the team with the lead. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Nicely cut out. Thiago Silva. Noni Madueke. Gallagher. And that was a very fine read. Welbeck. the pass could do damage and the flag has gone up here offside the decision March Gross and since they have the ball the referee playing advantage here and danger still well no damage done wonderfully weighted pass A good and fair challenge. And Chelsea looking dangerous. But quick thinking defensively. Welbeck. Caicedo. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. March. And a tidy tackle. And Chelsea come away with it. Pascal Gross. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. And a chance to level it. Excellent. 
excellent block by Thiago Silva. Ground to make up, and perhaps this corner can assist them. Gallagher. Now a decent position. It should be. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Now how about the short corner? Chilwell. And now Sterling. Now able to close down the short. Pascal Gross. Kaoru Mitoma. Possession lost by Brighton. And giving the ball away. Not a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Connor Gallagher and Havertz. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. A wonderful intervention. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Takes on the shots. Oh, terrific free kick. And how well the keeper did to parry it. Well, there we have it. We're up the halfway. So, back underway. And an intriguing second half in prospect. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well kept out. Played over. Oh, a disappointing effort, making the keeper's life a bit too easy. Sterling. Sterling. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish that's a clever goal so back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0 March McAllister well they stopped them in their tracks McAllister he read the situation defensively and did his job and he takes it on well, no mistake from the keeper, acting decisively. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Yes, it might be on for them once more. And cleared away. Gallagher tremendously strong in the tackle Kai Havertz Sterling oh he couldn't outwit the keeper 
Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Moises Caicedo. Oh, a nice-looking pass. Just couldn't capitalise there. This might be ideal for the counter. Oh, great attacking play. Well, it petered out. And Kai Havertz. No nonsense clearance. Now, who can he play it to? It's still alive! Conte. Well, really calm, composed goalkeeping there. It certainly was on the second attempt. It was the first save that really stood out. That was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping. I must say, this looks promising. Chance to cross. And the keeper was up to the task. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. He's driven in the corner. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Marvellous anticipation. And the short option preferred. Oh, bruising past him. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. And that'll be Brighton's ball. They couldn't maintain possession. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Delivered into the box. A oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Now, how about the short corner? And played in. Well, he didn't trouble the goalkeeper, but it wasn't a straightforward chance, you've got to say. Conte has lost the ball. Noni Madueke. James. Well, still an issue here. And an astute piece of defending. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Can they hit on the break? Real chance. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. Under pressure to get it away. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other...